Hello, I'm Mindy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a book review for A Spectral Hue by Craig Lawrence Gidney, which is a 2019 release from Word Horde, which is my favorite small press publisher because they published my favorite book, The Fisherman, by John Lingan. And I was super excited to check this one out. And I'm really glad that I did. A Spectral Hue is an own voices queer black novel. And it's about a town called Shimmer, Maryland where African-American artists have been drawn for generations to create art in this strange color, the color of the salt marsh orchid, which is a local flower that only grows in the marsh in this area. And the main character is Xavier, and he is drawn to this town after he sees a quilt made by Hazel Whitby, who was a slave in the 1800s who obsessively created quilts in this strange color. And we follow Xavier as he goes to Shimmer and discovers the mysteries of this town and why people are become so obsessed with this color and creating art and why it was why it draws some people in and why it totally repels other people this book is a fantasy weird fiction story and it's also kind of a ghost story but it's not horror even according to the author it's it's fantasy and it's weird fiction and it's definitely not scary at all it's more fantastical uh, it's very colorful with this uh, with a lot of this strange color that goes between pink and purple and it's almost psychedelic it is pretty psychedelic especially towards the end and the story starts out normal and then it gets more and more weird as the story goes on. And that's when I really started to love it. It's also a slow start. It's definitely a slow burn story. But I enjoyed it more and more as the story goes on. As more of the pieces of the story start to fit together and the supernatural aspect comes more to the forefront and as things get weirder and weirder it really started to pick up for me. I saw Craig Lawrence Gidney talk about this book on the Lovecraft easing video. I had him and a couple other African American horror writers and he did a reading from this book and it was so beautiful. It was almost poetic. He had a rhythm and a flow that that he read the first section of this book in. So I tried to keep that in mind while I was reading it and I read it in that rhythm the whole way through. And that also, I think, made me enjoy it more. Because I'm not sure that I would have picked, picked up on that rhythm but what if I hadn't have heard him read it that way? And it was really beautiful, poetic, and lovely. I really enjoyed reading this book, and I gave it four stars. Those are some of my thoughts on A Spectral Hue by Craig Lawrence Gidney. If you have read this book, I'd love to know what you thought of it. If you like this video, you can hit like and subscribe, and I'll be back very soon with another book-related video.
Thanks. Bye.